Hey guys, uh, so I thought I'd film a color test today. I'm going to just test out some new colors and types of paint that I want to use. I've been kind of trying to mess with uh, more non-toxic, less lethal paints. Earth green, got this cool color, which should even darken up a little bit more with oil on top. So we'll see, the earth green. And then I've also got peacock, should be cool. Then I got some low sheen finishing cream. Mmm, yeah, sweet. I'm gonna try a few different aerosol colors. Got some good stuff, got some good stuff. Uh, thought I'd try just like basic spray paints. I'm trying to go for like uh, I'm trying this Montana gold. I thought it would be fun. Cool colors. So this is Fjord. It's Fjord by Montana Gold. Fjord. Should be pretty cool. I don't know. It's like this bluish color. I got this Manila green. Mm. It looks tan on the thing, which is weird. And then, oh my god, I boxed it so tightly. I uh, thought I'd just try this fun for fun Rust Oleum Hunt Club green. And then, one more Rust Oleum Deep Forest green. Mm. So yeah, I'm trying to go for all these earth tones here. We'll see how it turns out and uh, take you guys through it all. Should be fun. So, woohoo! This is a mess. All right, so I'm gonna start with the milk paint. Mmm, comes in this little thing here. Mmm, this little pouchy pouch. Nice, very nice. And all you have to do is mix this stuff with water, which is cool. What? Just discovered a marble bead in here. Oh, it must be for mixing. That's cool. Hmm, beads. Cool. All right, so I just filled our two paints up with a little bit of water. I'm gonna go on the end here with this guy. Maybe letting it sit a little bit longer might help. As you can see, this is the peacock, and this is the earth green. So this is the manila. Oh, so with these, fun thing, they have a little safety thing in them, so you can't, you don't accidentally squirt something over yourself. Oh, yeah, there it is. Not as olive -y as that one, but it's pretty sweet. Let's try another color. Fjord. Hunt Club Green. Also, no priming or prepping of the wood. So, FYI, it's actually a pretty cool color. The last, but definitely not least, Deep Forest Satin. So, let the paint dry for about 30 minutes now. It's looking pretty good. Let me know what you guys think. Some of them are still drying, just FYI, but this is what we got so far. I've got the earth green, the peacock, hunt green, deep forest green, fjord, and manila. In a normal scenario, I probably would have laid down a primer, uh, and then obviously the wood would have been sanded and prepped really nicely. So they would have laid down more flat and you probably wouldn't be able to see as much wood grain, but it's a test, so whatever. Love to know what you guys think. <laughs> 